Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem 65 in chapter 9. In this problem, we will find the center of mass for the two dimension. We can see, first one, we have a uniform square. This mass is given, but it will not contribute to the center of mass, right? Because you can see, for this unified square, the mass of center for them is just as this orange. Agree? Yes. Now we have the three cars at the, this three point, x1, x2, and x3. The location is given. So that means the center of mass just depends on these three cars, right? This three car will make it shift. So we'll make it shift to the center of this orange. So how can we do that? First one, we consider the center of mass law. We can say we have mx1 plus mx2 plus mx3. Then we need to determine, divide by total mass. So this total mass should be this mass of this three car and also this square, right? So we need to plus m there. So a lot of students made a mistake there. So we need to must divide. Consider the total mass is 3m plus capital M. And then we can get the final answer. Very similarly, we can find the ycm equal to y, just uh, this uh, m times y1 plus m times y2 plus m times y3 and divided by total mass, we get the final answer. Thank you.